Well, tonight, a break in a murder on the North Shore that went unsolved for more than 35 years. The Essex, Essex District Attorney announced that detectives identified a suspect. And he was indicted by a grand jury today. WBZ's Chris Tanaka joins us in studio now. And Chris, the suspect is already behind bars. David, you are correct. Yeah, he's actually serving time for an attempted murder in 2008. But investigators here believe John Kerry is the man who killed Claire Gravel back in 1986. Now, early in the morning on June 29th, of that year, Claire's friends dropped her off at her apartment after a night out at a pub. Well, the next day, the 20 year old's body was found in the woods on the northbound side of 128 up in Beverly. Her father has carried that picture that you see in his wallet ever since, and detectives never gave up on the case and finally got the break they needed. Evidence recovered from Claire's clothing was instrumental in solving this case. He had been a person of interest, but again, every lead was pursued. Uh, relentlessly for the last 36 years and we feel confident based upon uh, the, the evidence we presented to the grand jury recently resulting in the return of the indictments today that we have the right person. That's incredible. Now the DA didn't say what the evidence was only that we're going to learn more when Gary appears in court for an arraignment. Gravel's siblings and father are still alive. The DA says they're grateful and sure relieved to hear a suspect has finally been identified.